Greetings, everyone. I thought I'd come to you from my kitchen right after making my tea. Got some two kinds of tea here. Matcha. I drink this first thing in the morning. I just wanted to finish that. Then I have some white chocolate peppermint with cocoa caramel already and caramel, caramel almond already and cocoa caramel sea salt. Anyhow, I want to talk to you briefly about your relationship with God. How wonderful is uh, the relationship that the Father chooses to have with us? He loves us very much. And in your important relationships in life, you, you, you know, say, for example, to your children or to your spouse, hey, I got an hour I'm going to spend with you right now. Um, so let's get this hour in. Well, nobody does relationships like that. Neither should our relationship with God be treated that way. Um, let your time with God just flow out of just natural fellowship with him on a daily basis. Instead of, okay, God, I got one hour. I'm, I need to get this hour in. See, you're, you're getting into a law, uh, requirements, and thinking that you need to spend this time with God. And No, let it flow naturally out of a love relationship with him that, hey, I want to spend time with my Heavenly Father. So spend time with him all day. Just <clears throat> be sensitive of his abiding presence. And for example, uh, you may want to um, take some time and close the door and get on your knees. At other times, you may want to ask God a question and you just sit down and ask him that question. And before you know it, uh, you're talking to God and he's talking to you for an hour and a half and you don't know where the time went. That's what happens when you enjoy somebody's presence. You get to talking to them, and before you know it, uh, a lot of time goes by. I, I spent some time with my campus pastor, Gary Regich, and I looked on my phone because it keeps track of the time. An hour and a half went by that we had been talking, and it didn't even seem like it. That's how our fellowship with God ought to be. There's times when you, you may be at work and you're having some trouble with a co-worker and you just want to ask God, to, Lord, help me uh, deal with this person. Show me what to do, how to respond to them. And that's all your prayer is at that time. You see, so talk to God all the time. Have little conversations with him throughout the day. Just the way you do with your spouse, your children. Sometimes you have a conversation with them for a couple minutes. Sometimes it may be an hour. But let your uh, time with God, your prayer with God, come out of, flow out of your love relationship with him. Because he's with you all the time. He'll never leave you or forsake you. I hope that helps your prayer life. Make it a great day.